Now, if I asked you guys what the best weapon on RuneScape is for PK, the answers would likely be Armadillo God Sword and the Karasi Sword. Now, the Karasi Sword is probably the best PK weapon in the game for many, many years on RuneScape 2 and even RuneScape 3, but it was never introduced onto old school RuneScape until now. Yesterday, the Wilderness Poll results came in, and as you can see, the Void Maker, which is basically a Karasi Sword, passed with flying colors, which is insane. Now, the weapon hasn't been added to the game yet, but you can test um, the beta version of it on tournament worlds. So freaking beautiful. Now this guy's just camping mage, so if something like this happens in PvP, you still have the AGS. Like beforehand players would just camp prey melee and you pretty much just cannot die. But now with the Void Waker, everything's different. Now obviously the Void Waker isn't in the main game yet. So as an early comparison, we're going to be using the Volatile Nightmare Staff since it is the closest weapon to the Void Maker because of its mage attack. That was actually really clean, not gonna lie. That's like a stack of 97 damage, holy shit. Total loot is not bad at all, just under 4 million GP. Judging by his strength, Amy, I'm pretty sure I wasn't meant to get this item. Yeah, I don't know, maybe you forgot to protect the item or we smited him. What the fuck was that? Second fight somehow went well as well. Let's have a look at the loot. 4.3 mil. Not bad. We're up like 10 mil. It's only been like five minutes. All right, lads, we're going to quickly pause the video as we have been generously sponsored by the one and only Yahaha. Now, they are a brand new user generated creation platform for 3D multiplayer interactive experience. Now, how cool is that? Anyone can create and publish their own virtual experiences. In fact, you don't have to have any coding experience or server knowledge to know how to use it. But simply use the components and assets that have already been provided in the studio and make your dreams come true. Yahaha also supports multiplayer, playing one game simultaneously in a one template or one game. Players can invite friends and hang out with them as well as meet new friends at any time in Yahaha 3D spaces and communities. If you guys like the sound of this or want to get a little nerdy, download Yahaha Studio today. In fact, you can click the link down below and join their early access right now for free. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, on the bright side, we hit a 75. We also swapped out of our Darok set, so we didn't actually lose that much. Oh, perfect. Kvibra, kind of like it in the void setup because you can stack it with Venge quite easily. Thank you for your 3.5 million GP. Very nice. So much happened without anything actually happening. Yeah, that was a stupidly unnecessary risk. So that's what PK with the volley looks like. I want to try the AGS for a little bit, just for like comparison. Because I'm pretty sure when the Karasi comes out, its accuracy is actually going to be similar to an AGS spec. Because an AGS spec is like 70 or 80% accuracy. <laughs> he is so unlucky. 4.3 mil. Very nice. Please fight me. Yes. That actually had so much potential. 0 on 50. Ah, oh, I can fight. You know what? We chanced it for 150 mil like twice, so can't be mad about that. If I'm right. Yeah, AGS is just something else. And we get 400k. That's like the smallest loot of the day so far. We've just been making bank. Oh my. That 76 came from nowhere. Good fight, good fight. Give me your 1.5 mil. No small loots today. Good to see. Oh 
Oh my. <laughs> now, unfortunately, our net actually cut out right here, which is not ideal. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video anyway. I'm really excited for the Karasi to come out. I am definitely going to have fun doing a whole bunch of combos that I can figure out with it. And once again, a massive shout out to the sponsor of the video, Yahaha. Links are in the description if you guys want to check them out. That is pretty much it. See you guys next time.